and welcome to another episode of Elastic Planet 21. And I am your host C, and I'm here with my wonderful co-host G as well. And today we have a fun, um, very extra, very playful doll. Um, this is the new Barbie Extra Barbie. Um, this is, I believe she's number 19, I think. Cause that's what it says on the thing here. I'm not 100 sure, y'all. Let me see what does it say here. Okay, she's Barbie Extra. She is the UFO themed doll. So that's one of the things that stuck out to me uh, when I saw her promotional pictures, which I will reference here in this video. I saw some of her promotional pictures and I was just like, hey, she's so cute. Even though this face is quite recycled, meaning like I see this face go often. I see it a lot, but um, I just liked everything this doll came with. I loved her fashion. I loved the, um, the skirt here, this beautiful, this plaid skirt with this um, beautiful, like kind of hot pink um, hoodie with like a, uh, kind of like a sweater hoodie. And she has like all those, what is this? All types of like stars and unicorns and ice cream cones and all types of like little cute pictures on her hoodie, which I think is pretty cool. Now these boots are definitely like outer space type boots. Like I've, I've never seen these type of boots uh, come out through Barbie before. So I'm very excited to take these out and get a close look at it. Um, there's her little promotion picture right there. Her pet panda. I think she's quite cute. She actually looks better in the cartoon than she does as translated into a doll, in my personal opinion. But um, before we go any further, I wanted to get some uh, wonderful opinions from my co-host here. And I want him to tell you what he thinks of this new uh, Barbie Extra doll. Okay. Um, she... So at first when we were talking about getting this doll, I wasn't um, <laughs> really into all the extra vegans per uh, she is, you know, her personnel, um, the way they created her. But that's okay because she, having her right now, I think it's a good purchase. I think it's just all the extra on the person is very simple. Mm -hmm. um, and. Uh, but she's supposed to be extra. She's Barbie extra. So I think they did good for that reason. She is extra. Everything about her is extra. The makeup. She looks like she's going to a carnival. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, yeah, in that sense, they hit the point. Mm -hmm. um, and actually looking at her up close, because I saw somebody make a review and her makeup, especially underneath the eyes, we're going to have a chance to look at her um, up close and out of the box. I didn't like that little clear gloss, like it looked whitish underneath the eye, but um, honestly, I think it looks good. Mm -hmm. Actually, um, now that I have her up close, I think it was, it's maybe lighting. Uh, that's doing that whenever the review of somebody else's that I watched but uh, in person actually that's that's really nice it's it's really nice on her face and um, I love her eye shape I love her the, her face I actually love her face it's just the extra the, the extravagance of the makeup and everything that's a little too much for me but I love her face I love her eyes I love the eyes not the eyebrows uh, it's cute. It's very unique, but I'm a simple person. So I love the eyes mm -hmm. So yeah uh, Excited to see her out of the box and see everything she comes with Absolutely, and I want to thank you so much for that um, um, Wonderful co-host because yes, I agree with everything you said. So first things first I'm gonna do is I'm going to um, we're gonna use a doll as a basically um, like a reference doll in this video that we can kind of like bounce ideas off of along with this doll so we can kind of create a Barbie extra um, like a we're gonna recreate this look with maybe materials you already have a uh, doll you know from different play sets or whatever so we're gonna do that in this video and we'll be right back after we open this doll and we're gonna get a closer look at her and out of the box, 
we have the girl here and she is on her stand i gave her her she has some beautiful like you know those very thin frame shades where it's like kind of translucent it's a beautiful kind of blue color i wanted to give you a close-up of these boots i think these boots are just otherworldly like they're so cool that platform there is cool uh the boots themselves are pretty awesome the plaid skirt it's just to die for and the belt is cute too but i just wouldn't have paired that belt with this in particular i would if if, if that belt i would have changed the shoes because i have some shoes that will go better with that but anyway i'm gonna let my co-host kind of tell you what he thinks about this doll and um we're gonna go have a little bit of fun and we're going to be um kind of redressing some other dolls in the inspired extra type fashion okay so you know how i said in the beginning that i didn't you know wasn't feeling the doll we look like that that much but <laughs> she's growing on me <laughs> actually she is growing on me we don't like the full smile but you know i'm gonna overlook it she is growing on me i can see us uh, I can see this doll being restyled, getting rid of those, um, the makeup that's made to be extra. I think they nailed it in the extra part, mm -hmm. you know, they nailed it into making her look extra, that uh, alienated look, Right. Um, they did a good job with that, you know, that belt made, made it even more crazy, like it wasn't supposed to be there, but <laughs> made it look crazy. But the doll itself, she... She's growing on me. Like, let's move the the, uh, um, the glasses. Oh, second there. No. And, 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 and I mean this with all the respect and all the love. Her eyes and the face of her shape is making me think of Kiki Palmer. Oh. Like, the shape of her eyes and the shape of her face is making me think of Kiki Palmer. Don't look at the makeup, don't look right. at anything else, just look at the focus on the eyes and the shape of the face. It's making me think of Kiki Palmer. Oh. And Kiki Palmer is a gorgeous, gorgeous woman. Yes, and, you're right, look at that. Yes, and 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 I just see so much potential with this doll. I think yes. it was a good choice for this extra, because she's carrying it in the theme of extra, she's carrying it well. That's but other than that, I mean, look at all those accessories she's coming Beautiful. with. Beautiful. Like the whole set, I wasn't, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm not really um, knowledgeable in dolls, but uh, the whole set said, uh, this set is for a play, it's a play set for kids. Correct. This gives children a lot of ideas. Bright colors, kids love bright colors, and uh, all those stuff, kids have a lot of things to to play with, to change, move around. This is just a child's dream, in my opinion. So, creativity, cre creativity, genius, I think. Genius. They did really, really well. Okay, and we are back with our Barbie Extra doll that we are unboxing today. She's our UFO kind of theme doll. I believe she's number 19. I've been saying UFO theme because but I believe she's number 19 in the Barbie Extra. Um, she is very cute we basically had just kind of ran over all of her accessories and everything that she comes with but we're going to do now in the video is now we've reached the segment of the video where we are going to show you our version of this doll so we basically did a little bit of a collaboration me and my wonderful co-host here we did a collaboration with the 1959 bmr doll it is the claudette face sculpt I believe and basically this is how she looks this is of course you know I love dolls that are not smiling they have the more serious face so that's kind of why I chose her and like I said due to her skin complexion and the hair color she had a lot of similarities to the current doll um, but she will give you a little bit of a close-up my beautiful girl here and this is her accessories guys that we did we chose this beautiful uh kind of uh, metallic polka dot top with um this skirt this plaid skirt 
We paired it with these silver strappy type gladiator sandals. Also, I gave her this beautiful metallic puffer jacket. And if you can see there, she has a beautiful ring there. It's like um, finger jewelry. And in the other hand, she has a beautiful bear, it's blue. And um, I gave her star earrings along with um, a silver headband. So what we're gonna do now is I'm gonna get my wonderful co-host to tell you what he thinks about our collaborative doll and the Barbie Extra number 19 as well. All right guys, um, as you can see, we were really trying to match uh, Put them both on theme, mm -hmm. which is being um, extra. Right. Like they're not acting extra. It's just the looks we creating uh, to be extra. Like like the, this is the reason why you see uh, colored hair. But on top of the colored hair, we have headbands. Mm -hmm. We have necklaces with a lot of um, I don't have to call those things. Charms. Charms, and you have bigger stuff. So we really trying to just be on theme. And um, I think um, I think we we did it we did a good job I, I think. Agree. But you guys let us know in the comments what you think about the look. Uh, obviously, you see we kind of kept the plaid uh, skirt mm -hmm. theme, yeah. and um, that was not really on purpose. Um, you see the Barbie extra number nineteen. She has a, a pink uh, top and a pink. Um, goth. I, I don't want to call it goth, but the the boots. Yes. I love those boots, by the way. The details, the color. Yes. It's really cute. It's really cute. If I were a doll, I would wear it. <laughs> um, but I think we. Did I think, pretty I think good. we did better. If I, I think if we it, did pretty it, good. I think we did an, an awesome job. And if we're and if you're going to just uh, keep into account that this is galaxy themed, this is kind of space themed, it's kind of you know uh, UFO themed or whatever, I think we hit the nail on the head. Honestly, I mean, you know, I, I I mean personally, I just think that the doll that we chose is cuter doll. So of course, you know, I'm a little bit biased because I love Claudette so much in this face sculpt. But overall, you tell us in the comments what you think of the two looks because, um, yes, this was a complete um, collaboration between me and the wonderful co-host here on the left, and this is how the doll came on the right, the Barbie Extra number 19. So all of you in the comments, drop down, tell us what you think about the doll. Also, one, lastly, but not leastly, I wanted to also briefly mention that this doll, her hair came with no product. So the hair is soft to the touch, very soft. It feels really good, actually. Um, very nice quality. It needs some help because of the box, but. Yeah, she definitely has box hair. I definitely agree with that. It's frizzy and it's a little unkept. So she does have box hair, but the way it feels, I must say it feels really nice. It feels soft and I can't wait to take her out of all these accessories and stuff so that I can really like give her a completely different look. Mm -hmm. And um, thank you all for watching us today in this video. Like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Turn on your post notifications so that you'll be notified for the future videos. And you know, if you have not subscribed to our channel, please consider subscribe, subscribing if this is uh, content you enjoy watching or if you've come back multiple times please consider subscribing uh, but we want it to be your choice uh, thank you again absolutely thank you all for watching us today we'll see you in our next video bye 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 bye